Welcome to the Hire Me podcast. I'm Chris Lynn. And I'm Heather Balsarek. We are excited to introduce you to an amazingly talented professional today. You're going to learn who they are, what they do, and what they value in under 10 minutes. So come elevate your game as we elevate today's top talents. Welcome to the Hire Me podcast. My name is Chris Lynn, and today I am here with the amazing Heather Balsarek. Welcome to the podcast. Excited to talk to you today. Oh, Chris, I'm so excited to be here. Like, this is amazing. Fantastic. Well, let's just jump right into it. Tell us who you are. Oh, well, Chris, my name is Heather Balsarek. Uh, I am a global leadership and talent development professional, program manager, manager, whatever ending you want to put on that. Uh, I have been in this space in some form or fashion for over 12 years. Let me date myself. I started when I was 10. Um, and that's, yeah, that's, that's, that's the short version. <laughs> awesome. Fantastic. <laughs> so as you're in this job market, what type of role are you looking for? So I'm definitely looking to stay in the, the leadership and talent development field. Uh, I've worn many, many hats um, around the learning and development space. So I'm really comfortable uh, either designing presentations or e-learnings or video content. But in my next role, I really want to focus on like the development of the programs and partner with instructional designers and learning technology specialists that can truly execute those functions at a higher skill level than I can. Um, And I would love to work for a company that values remote work and a work-life harmony for their employees. That's awesome. What do you love about your work? Oh, how much time we got, Chris? (laughs) Um... (laughs) I I really love this work because it allows me to help others reach their goals. And with leadership development, right, I can help leaders create teams with psychological safety that will be more effective and efficient in delivering on the business goals. And that's really the overarching reason for why I love this work. But I want to talk a little bit about the nitty gritty, right? What do I like about like the actual job? Um, I do love developing programs, right? I want to figure out how to fill those knowledge gaps in innovative ways that can meet the customer where they are. And then getting to design that content, right? What it looks like, what it feels like, that stuff gives me a lot of energy. And finally, facilitating the content and seeing the light bulbs that go off as participants start connecting the dots between the concepts and their role. Like that's, that's why I love this work. That's awesome. Love it. So what type of leadership and culture will help you thrive? Oh, great question. Um, So I'm looking for a company culture that values development from the top level all the way down and where psychological safety isn't just a buzzword, right? It's not just you know, uh, corporate jargon that they throw around, right? They really mean it. They really value that. Uh, and like I said before, right, I'm looking for somewhere where work-life harmony is, is important because it's extremely important to me um, because I want the company, the culture to truly support people taking time away and actually being away. Um, collaboration is another part of a, of a team or company culture that I'm looking for, because that is essential for making development programs great. Um, I'm also interested in how they approach uh, the like neurodivergence. So people with um, things like um, autism or on the autism spectrum or ADHD um, or a, a myriad of other types of neurodivergence. And, uh, and that goes right into kind of what are their DEI initiatives and how does this all go together um, in their company uh, culture, their values, their mission. And with a leader, I'm looking for someone that's supportive, but gives me the space to grow and learn. Um, I want a leader that gives me autonomy and allows me to make a mistake, but focuses on the learning opportunity that the mistake gives me versus focusing on the mistake. Um, And I want a leader 
that, you know, teaches me how to fish versus just giving me all the answers, right? So you can send me in the right direction and, and let me figure it out um, without just giving me the direct links or, or something like that. And it's essential to me that the leader is kind and empathetic and creates that psychologically safe space. Yep. That's fantastic. That's great. So what problems can you solve for companies? Oh, this is one of those hard questions, Chris. Um, <laughs> <laughs> all of them. I can solve all the problems. Um, no, in all honesty, my specialty is delivering leadership and talent and development programs from the ground up or taking something someone started and left behind and, and taking that to become a value added program for the organization. Uh, and an example I have of this is a career development program that I launched back in 2020 during my time at Apple. And so previously, um, individuals had tried to offer career, career development sessions to our organization, um, but nothing ever really worked. So I took that idea of offering workshops and I ran a pilot of evening workshops that aligned with the schedule of the advisors in the organization and participation wasn't there. So I understand why they had dropped this program, but I didn't stop, right? I, I developed a program that would give that information to our advisors in multiple ways because they were hungry for it. Um, and one of the ways was to continue offering workshops and then have the recordings available for those that could not attend. And then I was able to take that content and break it down into smaller pieces and put that into team meetings. Um, and that way it could reach more advisors. Um, and then I trained our team managers how to deliver this content and how to gain confidence in their skills around reviewing a resume or helping with interview practice skills or job searching. And then finally, we launched um, an internal website. So this grew from a very small pilot into a whole program. Uh, and we launched an internal website that acted as a hub for all of this content. Um, and, and really, like I said, the project grew to more than more than just me, right? We had a team of area managers and team managers. And to my knowledge, this content is still in place today because I get messages from my friends over there. They're like, Heather, we saw your video today, heard your voice, miss you. <laughs> so it's still in place today. And it's something I'm extremely proud of. That's fantastic to hear. Well, that's great. Uh, to wrap up, what matters to you? What are the, what are your main values that, that you uh, subscribe to? I'm going to keep this pretty short and sweet, right? What matters to me is helping others. It is the core of my personal mission. People matter to me. I never want someone to feel left out or like they can't accomplish their dreams because they can, you can, and I can. So that's, that's the big thing for me. That's fantastic. Well, Heather, thank you again so much for coming on the Hire Me podcast. We'll uh, be sure to make sure that we get your name out there and we are looking forward to the next step in your journey. Absolutely. Looking forward to connecting to everyone on LinkedIn. <laughs>